Curious George, librarian for a day. George goes to the library once a week. This time, the librarian, Miss Dewey, asked George to help her. Miss Dewey gave George a card. It held books and DVDs. George had to sort them into two piles. George was super fast. Then, Miss Dewey had to leave in a hurry. Her book club needed her. She put George in charge of the library. George wondered, should he put the books away? It seemed like something a monkey in charge would do. George put the books away in record time. This librarian stuff was easy. Then the doorman came into the library. Hi George, said the doorman. Can you help me find my dog Hundley's favourite book? It's a yellow book. George was very familiar with that colour. The yellow books George found were not the white ones. There were a lot of yellow books. Finally, George found the right book. Thanks, George, said the doorman. Finding books was hard. George was curious. Would the books be easier to find if they were sorted by colour? After George sorted the books, Chef Spaghetti came in. I can't find my cat Gnocchi's favourite book. Mice everywhere, he said. George just needed to know what colour the book was. The chef didn't know the book's colour. He did know that it was a very, very big. George looked for a big book. There were big books in every colour. At last, George found the white one. It was heavy. Thanks, George, said the chef. George decided to try putting the books in order of size Little books, medium books, big books. George had fixed the library again. But then Steve needed help too. George, the books are all messed up, Steve said. This is where all the outer space books are supposed to be. George showed how he'd sorted the books by size. I don't think that's how libraries work, Steve said. He showed George where all of the books about outer space were supposed to be. This made George even more curious. George wondered, if all the outer space books go together, maybe books are organised by subject. Steve said the subject is what the book is about. George needed to fix the library again before Miss Dewey came back. Steve helped George sort the books by subject. It's neat as a pin in here, Miss Dewey said when she returned. She explained that books are arranged by subject and then alphabetically by the author's last name. Alphabetically means in the same order as the letters of the alphabet. Names that start with letter A come before names that start with B, and names that start with Z go last. Z is the last letter of the alphabet. Richard had fun helping at the library, but he was happy to go home with his own favourite book. The End